Hi CHW fans and Facebook friends, it's Nikki Chance with another edition of my Q&A. So, um, I'm doing this today to address a few questions about uh, my issues, address the match that I had, and uh, to talk a little bit about Agent Exiles match as well as answer the questions. So, I'm going to answer some questions that I didn't get to last week. So, starting off with uh, Damian Rockford, he asked, uh, Nikki, would you like to end the streak? Uh, the streak, of course, referring to Undertaker's WrestleMania streak. Um, I don't think there's a wrestler in the world who wouldn't like to end the streak, so yes, I would definitely like to. Um, Christopher David at the Davison asked, uh, do you like boxing or UFC? Um, no, I'm not a big boxing or UFC fan. It's never been something that I've gotten into. Uh, Luke Larkin asked, um, I'm going to answer some of your newer questions. So you asked who will be my next CHW opponent. Um, from what I hear, there's a big announcement happening this Saturday on CHW, so I'm going to wait and find out about that before I say anything. I'd really like to face Miniac, or Suede, or maybe even the CHW Champion Innovator, or Matt Rage for the Interstate Championship, but there's nothing confirmed yet. Uh, you asked, what would your view uh, on a rematch against Suede be? Um, well, as Suede's mentioned, there's not going to be a rematch, at least not this season. But I would really like to have one with him. I think now that I've had a little bit more experience, uh, I think I'd be able to beat him. Um, you also asked, do you have any New Year's resolutions? Um, other than, you know, the get healthier, stay fit kind of thing, not really. Um, I have from Jacob Philia Pack. Um, you asked, um, what is your favorite Royal Rumble return? Um, I'm going to have to say it was when Diesel returned, uh, Kevin Nash, he returned as the character Diesel, and he got, like, a gigantic pop from the fans. It was fantastic. Um, I have a question, a couple of questions from Forrest Ruiz. Um, he asked, who do you think has the best entrance theme in WWE? Um, I pro I really like Mark Henry's entrance theme. I think it's uh, I think it's funny, you know, like the somebody gonna get their ass kicked kind of thing, especially since it's PG television. Um, and you also asked, what are your thoughts on Daniel Bryan joining the Wyatt family? Um, I think it's stupid they made him lose his first match back uh, from being, uh, joining the Wyatt family. Uh, although I'm really liking the whole Wyatt family thing right now. Um, WWE Jamal09, one of my YouTube fans, asked uh, two questions about my, th uh, well first off, my thoughts on Ryback. Um, sort of a overplayed wrestler, he, he's strong, but he's blocky in the ring. And he asked, if you were in WWE, would you still keep uh, Nikki Chance as your name? Um, yes, I'd really like to keep Nikki Chance as my name and come out with my cards and talk a little bit, although it doesn't really fit like a WWE entrance thing, so um, it's not exactly something I think they would like, but I would love to still stay as Nikki Chance. Um, Michael Miner asked, um, who's your favorite, uh, who's um, your mentor that brought you into backyard wrestling? Um, this question has a bit of a long answer, I'm going to try to go through it quick. Um, basically, um, my father was a referee for uh, some wrestling uh, feds in the past. Um, I grew up sort of around wrestlers and watching wrestling. Uh, my brother, actually, um, is a referee. Um, you might see him in some CHW matches. Uh, and he basically told me about CHW. He said, well, you know, if you want to get trained, there's people there that can help you. So I, I sent in a video, and here I am. Um, and I have a few combination questions. Uh, first, I had Ray Carson and Damian Rockford ask, uh, why did Eric D. retire, and what do you think of him retiring? He retired because he wanted to pursue a career in bodybuilding. Um, and you uh, asked, what do I think of him? Well, <laughs> I think to go out like he did is kind of lame. I think that if you want to be... Um, if you decide to be a wrestler, that you should go out fighting. You should have a match to... Somebody should end your career. That's just how it should go. Uh, Ray Carson and Christopher Davison asked, what do you think of Brock Lesnar and his return to WWE? Um, I like that they're starting something between him and Big Show. Um, I'm not entirely liking the fact that he was just able to take out Mark Henry like he was nothing, though. Um, oh, and well, it's good that Paul Heyman's back. Uh, Damien Rockford and Christopher Davison asked, uh, are you going to feud with Miniac or with S&M? 
Uh, I keep trying. <laughs> you know, I've, I've issued challenges and they just haven't accepted them. So we'll see where it goes. And Ace and WWE Jamal09 asks, What do you think of the Shield? Who's your favorite member and who should be the leader? Um, I really like the Shield. I've pretty much liked them since they come, uh, came in, but I don't like the fact they keep doing the whole, you know, triple power bomb take out somebody thing. Uh, who's your favorite member? Um, I think it's a clear choice that Roman Reigns is my favorite member. I really don't like Dean Ambrose's face, and Seth Rollins is kind of eh. And who should be the leader? Um, Nikki Chance should be the leader of the Shield. Um, no, that's just that's a cheap answer. But um, I obviously I'm thinking Roman Reigns should be the leader. Although Dean Ambrose does kind of direct traffic. I would prefer Roman Reigns though. Um, so now I'm going to talk a little bit about my injury. Obviously, as you can see, um, I've got my head bandaged up right now. Um, I took a bit of a beating with the match with Executor. He definitely um, beat me up. <laughs> uh, I got the injury from coming off the sliced bread. Uh, his knee and my head collided. Um, you can actually see that he's uh, that he's holding his leg and whatnot afterwards, too. Um, <laughs> my head actually got me the win, what do you know? Um, but yeah, the, there's no concussion. Um, I'm pretty much healthy. They said it's going to heal probably in about a week or so. Um, I'm just keeping pressure on it, icing it a lot. Uh, it's made me dizzy, very tired, but I'm okay. Um, and I'd also like to talk about Agent Exile and Innovator. Um, I'm glad that my friend Agent Exile is getting his shot at the CHW Championship. And a little funny fact, if Agent Exile wins the championship, he'll be the first person to ever win the CHW Championship twice in history. So it's definitely something to look forward, um, look forward to on the weekend. Um, so yeah, that's uh, pretty much all I'm going to talk about today. Uh, thank you guys for watching. You can uh, add me as a friend on Facebook. You can uh, like the CHW page. You'll get up to date information all the time. They run little articles and stories. And uh, subscribe to me on YouTube and the uh, CHW Backyard YouTube page. Thanks guys. Um, have, be safe.